welcome my dear little friends my students i am back again with a new video we are going to learn how to solve numerical problems related to density but before going into the discussion we need to remember that density can be defined as mass per unit volume and its mathematical form is this in other words we need to have both mass and volume to determine density it is clear from mathematical expression that there are three physical quantities mass volume and density by using this expression we can find any of them if the other two are given therefore we can practice the following four types of numerical problems with the help of this mathematical expression and this video the mass of the object is given as 50 g its volume is 100 cc to determine the density we can apply this formula density is equal to mass divided by volume if we put the values mass is 50 g volume 100 cc by dividing these two we get 0.5 since all the units are given in cgs system therefore the density is 0.5 g per cc but we have to convert it into its si unit we know 1 g per cc is equal to 1000 kg per meter cube therefore 0.5 g per cc will be is equal to 1000 multiplied by 0.5 is equal to 500 kg per meter cube in this example density is given 20 kg per meter cube and the volume but here also we will apply the same formula density is equal to mass divided by volume and we will put the corresponding values density 20 mass we don't know we, we will find out volume 10 therefore mass is equal to density multiplied by volume 10 into 20 200 and since all the units are given in si system so mass is 200 kg here again density is given along with the mass of the object again we will apply the same formula density is equal to mass by volume and we will put the corresponding values here density is 8.4 so in place of density we have written 8.4 in place of mass we have written 138.6 and the volume we will find out therefore volume is equal to mass by density 138.6 divided by 8.4 if you divide you will get 16.5 and definitely cc because it is in cgs system In this example we are going to find out the density of a cuboidal solid means this solid is regular shaped solid we know there are different formulae for finding out the volume of regular shaped solids since it is cuboid the dimensions are given you can assume 6 cm as length Four uh, centimeter as breadth and three centimeter as its height. Mass is also given. Here mass is given hundred eight gram. Volume will be determined 
by multiplying length with breadth with its height if you put the values 6 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 3 definitely cc and it is 72 cc we have written here 72 so density is equal to mass divided by volume if you put the values mass is 108 volume is 72 if you divide you get 1.5 gram per cc but again you have to find out the density in SI system so remember 1 gram per cc is equal to 1000 kg per meter cube therefore 1.5 gram per cc is equal to 1000 multiplied by 1.5 that is 1500 kg per meter cube this is its uh, density in SI system 